What's going on gamers, RC Styles here. Today we're going to continue with our Walking Dead Survival Instincts playthrough and uh, leading into tonight's Friday Night Frights. Uh, today we are going to the town of Garwater, so let's get ready and get into this. Okay, so we can take the long way. We're traveling at night there, traveling at night there too. That's Pemberton. We gotta go to Garwater. There's no way around that one. So let's go ahead. Uh, highway is low fuel usage. Might break down. Um, we're gonna go ahead and take the highway for video's sake. Shame won't make it. We gotta pull off and find the ride. Don't much like the idea of stopping at night. It's too hard to see. Maybe we ain't got a whole lot of choice. Can't be too careful until we know more about it. Yeah, I'm a stroke. First thing we're going to do here is at the start of the level, we're going to go ahead and find the officer near the beginning, and he'll give us a double barreled shotgun, and then we can progress from there. Now, remember, stealth and scavenging are the key to this game. So let's go ahead and get this started. We're going to go ahead and send him out while we can. He has a bolt action rifle. The key to us traveling is gas, so we're going to make sure there's a 50% risk with him, but I'm telling you, don't worry, he is not going to die because he's a key character, so we're going to keep that in mind. Alright, so we got him situated. Let's go over to Jimmy Blake. Jimmy Blake prefers, yeah, prefers pistols and rifles, so let's give him a weapon. And normally I would have him scavenge, but today we're going to have him stay at the car. We'll go back. Go our pack. Remember, we just want to carry the absolute necessities. We're running low on food and drink here. Alright. So we definitely want to keep an eye out for food. Alright, so we have that, but we're not going to use it. Remember, when we come in here, we want to stay low. And scavenge for anything we can find along the way. First, check these cars in between these cars. I don't see nothing in between them. Stand back up. I don't see anything up in here. Nothing there. Let's turn our light back out and crouch. We don't want to draw any unnecessary attention to us right at the moment. Check around these cars. There's going to be plenty of materials and supplies around here. We just got to watch out for the walkers. This guy's done. All 
Alright, let's move on. Sorry guys, I had myself turned around there for a second. Alright, let's be careful, we'll move on, but we're going to be careful here. Got flare. Right. Careful now. Uh oh. I think you saw me. down here. Shit! Saw me. Catch it. All right, bottle. Use that. There's supposed to be a hat around here somewhere we can grab. Find something to help me out here now, man. Dude, anything? Come on now. Look, squirrel. 
There's the square we need. Oh, give me that damn squirrel. At least one of these. <laughs> I can't believe we didn't really find shit there, man. That's bull. Let's continue on. Anything else I need to be aware of right now. Something tells me I don't want to just go barging in the front door. Let's see if there's a way around back first. Looks like we're clear to head in. Search the place first, man, for real. Some eerie shit there. Miss one of the collectibles. I'm gonna have to go back in another playthrough and hopefully get that one. Shit, man. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's find out what else we got to do to set up for the next match, uh, next town. 
All right, we lost Jess on that one, but we still got Jimmy. Let's see what else happened here. 38 fuel, got plenty of ammo. Looking good, guys, looking good. All right, so that's going to take us into our next town. Now, that also means that will be our next video. So what I'm going to ask you all to do is hit that like and subscribe button. Smash that notification bell so you don't miss out on more kick-ass content from me and Gamers Purgatory. And as always, I will catch you in the next video. Peace.